We are getting ready to do our is Aquarius in a third party relationship, baby. Ooh, it's Aquarius. I'm going to put those back because I am not ready yet. Thank you. This is a timeless reading, so it may or may not. Ooh, it may or may not uh, resonate with you. Excuse that noise, y'all. I got my balcony go crack because um, I'm burning this sage and incense. Uh, is Aquarius in a third party relationship? This may or may not resonate with you. So if it does, that's fine. If it doesn't, it's still all good in the neighborhood. Okay? This is for your sun, your rising, your sun, your moon, your Venus, your cross watchers, and your cuspers. Okay? And it's timeless. It's fluid. It's energy. So whenever you get it, baby doll, baby boy, you are meant to have it. That's what I'm talking about. Is Gemini in a third, I mean, not Gemini, I'm sorry. Is Aquarius, yeah, I just finished Gemini. Is Aquarius in a third party relationship is what we would like to know. So it be looking like others be flipping when they do it like that. It's the way it flips out of there. Oh, my, 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 my. Somebody done walked away from some body or something or someone and you sitting here with the queen of wands baby Ooh, we in a social gathering about to meet somebody about to stumble up on a divine feminine energy that's gonna light your fire oh aquarius where is y'all going where is you off to Oh, Lord. And you don't pull the queen of swords. Boy, the truth is coming for you. Bad boy, bad boy. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. When it comes for you. Mm-hmm. Oh, look at that. I can't even flip the cards. What is y'all doing, Aquarius? Feeling stabbed in the back by the queen of wands. Okay. This is you. This is your person. This is y'all in the middle together. Ooh, rest and recovery. I don't see no third party yet. Two more cards, spirits. Something flipped. Yep, there it is. Queen of Cups. Ooh, they be smooth with it. My ancestors be over there. Bam. My ancestors be slick with this stuff. One more card, spirit source energy. One more card is Aquarius having a third party relationship. Are oh, they cheating? But dang. I ain't want that many. I'm finna just put them back up in there. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody calling judgment on somebody. Who done messed over who? Is is Aquarius having a... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Y'all saw that? Ooh, somebody in trouble. Ooh. Put my queen of the cup back up there and get the rest of these because somebody in trouble. Aquarius. Let's see what fell out of Uh-huh. Hmm. Somebody in a third party relationship. Somebody is a lying competition in the house. Mm, 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 mm. Underland card, third party, mm. hangman, emperor, and the nine of cups. I don't know what it is with this emperor and this nine of cups, baby, but he be bringing it. We're going to leave him right yonder. Somebody in Aquarius' house met somebody or went after somebody, baby. Mm. Ooh, wait, somebody feelings was not getting fulfilled, baby. And they crept on out that damn door on y'all ass. I'm just a messenger. Check your boo-boo. Check your baby. Okay, I'm just a messenger. Somebody got tired. 
of their emotions getting played with, getting ran over, not getting met is the overlaying energy and they looked in another direction, baby. Oh, now this is getting serious. This is about the serious one I done had, okay, since I've been reading it for all signs. And you sitting up here feeling needed, suffering, ooh, feeling like you poor in poverty because your, your emotional needs ain't getting met. Feeling broke, busted, and goddamn disgusted. Woo! Okay, I'm finna put it together for you. That's all I'm saying. I'm just following in it. I ain't got shit to do with it. Don't get mad at me. You better check your boo and your bait. That's all I got to say. <laughs> check your boo. Ooh, I need a drink. Wait a minute. This is getting hot. Oh, that, I mean, like the real fire hot. <laughs> mm. Go on down there and order y'all some Arbonne. Because y'all going to love it. You're going to need it after all this reading here. Whew, wait a minute. Oh, somebody done walked away. Made you feel like you didn't have nothing. Left you in need. Left you empty-handed, baby. Feeling like your needs wasn't being met. Oh, and you had a lot, a lot, a lot of passion and love. You were sitting in your power now. You going out. You hanging out now. Oh, yeah, you about to strike it even like Steven, baby. Woo, don't y'all play with a sister up in here. Don't y'all play with me. Look at this. Look at that. And you done called in the queen of swords coming up in there like, oh, gosh, I got a clear mind now. I'm going to see through that BS right now and cut it down with a with them blades. Okay, with that, with that truth. And then here you are because you done lost out. Somebody done lost out. Feeling stabbed in the back, face to the ground, can't say nothing, can't communicate, ain't take, can't take no more action because you just face down. Ooh, you just face down, boy. Was that some deception and the trickery and backstabbing for your ass, baby? That's some defeat right there, boy. You is feeling defeat. He or she, whoever it is, flip it how you got to flip the pancake, baby, because, whoo, but you came up under this queen of wands looking at this cup. That the universe done gave you wondering what the muck. <laughs> What's going on here? But you got a rat there trying to get the rest of your cups of emotion. Trying to drink your water, but you coming up in here all green. Like the green goblin and the magician. Knowing that you done, the, the queen of wand that came up in the building, baby at that gathering and got you in a daze and she done put that magic potion on you baby Woo! you know what i'm talking about mm -hmm. got your nose wide open <laughs> you forgot about <laughs> got your nose so wide open you forgot about being stabbed in the back baby and started moving toward that direction <laughs> You forgot all about that, baby. You said, wait, hold up, wait a minute. Let me move this trail right on along. You left it behind, baby, and moved and started traveling and moving around, baby. Ooh, Lord. Let me, let me, let me. And when you did that, ooh, did you stumble across Rick A. Suave number one? Ooh. The emotion for the ocean, baby. <laughs> y'all. <laughs> y'all nasty. <laughs> y'all some haunted little jokers, boy. You done stumbled across when you got the moving around and you met the queen of wands, baby. And she did that what she did to you. Baby, you said, let me go over here. Because it's got something over here I want, baby. And you went out that door looking, smelling good from head to toe, baby. And you stumbled across this page of cups that got what you need. Ooh, somebody get me some water. 
Because it's a getting hot up in here. Look at them both holding that cup. Baby, they got some emotions hidden in that joker. He's got a light. Ooh, Lord. Her got some look like little steam and some little water and some little. Ooh, my, my, my. Mm, mm, mm. We're going to let that sit right there and marinate for a minute while we go on over here to this third party situation. Okay. So, what had happened was that you felt betrayed because somebody was doing something behind your back. Right? With them swords. With them ten of swords, right? Felt defeated, felt stabbed in the back because you was put in a situation that you didn't want to be in. Right? You did not want no third party relationship going on behind your back. <laughs> Can I get an amen? So, <laughs> so once that happened, you had lost your balance. You started feeling sorry until the Queen of Wands stepped in the building and let loose all of that passion on you and did all that magic rendezvous, whatever it was y'all did, baby, release the blockage you had going on. You broke through. You released it. You removed it. Baby, the dang on hangman came up in there. And your heart of the matter is rest, baby. Because, see, you released it. You didn't let it heat, like eat it, eat you up for so long. You was like, uh-uh. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Because she came in there, like I said, with that magic and that wand, baby, acting like the magician over you and resurrecting you. Somebody stepped out of the relationship because their needs wasn't being met. Okay, now after, she, after the hangman, you come up in there feeling all brand new like the emperor taking charge again. Taking that power back, that masculinity back, that self-control back, chest out. Hmm. Walking in that authority and that leadership. And then, what do you know? You got your emotional stability back. You said, hold up, wait one minute. I am more than that situation. That situation ain't going to keep me down. I'm going to learn from my past. Chills. And move on. Because I got too much to offer, baby. I'm going to set you right there by the emperor where you belong. And that's what's going on. It was a conflict. It was a competition going on. It was a heavy load weighing you down. It was some secrets being kept in the relationship about where the spending was going, where the money was going. Somebody was hiding something in the relationship, baby. And it came to light. Now, why y'all got Spy Kitty? Because now you got a new flame going on. And Spy Kitty want to know, is that new flame finna reap the rewards of the emotional cup they could have had, baby, with you? Ooh, tell it like it is, baby. Tell it like it is because of that broken heart, baby. What you say, what you say, what you say. Look at that broken heart. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now you done left Spy Kitty with a broken heart. You done called out the strength. The strength coming. Here come the hair of coming. Ooh, 
and here come the star coming. And here come, look at that, you finna be well known. You, you, you ruling as the Hierophant. The Hierophant marriage, you thinking about marrying this person. This person giving you that advice, that leadership, that guidance that you need. You thinking about marrying that person. And you getting the strength from the universe. Ooh, you got control of the ego. You ain't even got to look at the lion. You just know you moving forward with him. Ooh, boy, she put something on you. He or she put something on you. You ain't never experienced before. Brought the hierophant out of your ass. <laughs> now you seeing stars <laughs> in a good way. You like finna be well known, that energy, that, that magical magician energy. Baby finna rise y'all to the top. Look at that. And y'all following the light of y'all love and y'all relationship. You mended this very well. This came together very well for you. Baby, it was meant to happen. That person was not for you. That person wasn't even meant. To enjoy them cups you was working on. Them emotional fulfillment cups that you was working hard. That you planted those seeds for. And now they down there spying on you. Because they got the broken heart now. Oh, they got the broken heart now. The three of swords. The suffering. Woo, they got it now. And look at him. And you got the victory, Gemini. Woo, what I tell y'all about playing up in here with me. Look at him. Bam. And you guarding that pinnacle. Woo, where you guarding that pinnacle? See how the sun done came out and moved everything around for you? Baby, you got it going on, baby. That... That was meant to happen. You ain't got to cry over spilled milk. You ain't got to moan. You ain't even got to worry about. You just know Kitty, Spy Kitty is watching. Okay? They watching your move because they want to come after what you got. But you got your new Queen of Wands, Queen of Cups up in the building, baby. Your strength, you got it back. You working as the hair of fan up in here. Boy, 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 boy. The Emperor and the hair of fan. Woo! You fence to be a star, baby, in, in your uh, community. Maybe on the news. I don't know. But you finna be well known. You must be writing books. You must be doing something to get you in the public eye. You public speaking, motivating speaking. You doing something to get some attention on you, baby. Because it's coming in. It's coming in, baby. Ooh, ooh. You had a third party, Gemini. But it wasn't on your account. <laughs> it wasn't on nothing that you was doing. It was on something else your partner was doing. Your other person was doing. You was about the business. You had you was working the business of it. But I'm going to say this. For those who might listen, it might resonate with. You can't be so engulfed in business that you forget to love your partner. People will creep out. If their needs ain't being met in the bedroom emotionally fulfilled if they ain't giving attention baby they gonna go where the affection is you got to give that affection it has to be a balance of love home and business right your work your business and your love your home life you have to balance that out because people it's only so much some people can take others may be able to take that for a while as part of a sacrifice to getting the relationship where it needs to be. But some people can't take that type of distance. So you have to learn to, you know, meet them affectionate and those tender needs at the house 
while you're working on what you're working on building. But at the same time, if the person get busted, then that what that person wasn't meant to be in your success to build, you know, to finish building that it had to come to light. What's done in darkness comes to light. We know that, right? What we plant comes to light. You know, our harvest, right? As our harvest, as our manifestation. So you had some idea something was going on. Maybe she or he started acting funny, tipping out a little bit later, staying out a little bit later, making excuses or whatever, and you got suspicious. And when you got suspicious, you brought that energy in and that it manifested so that you could find out before you put any more time in the relationship. You could have been doing everything right. You or your person, whoever I'm speaking to, but they just wasn't doing their part. It could have been that way. But however, you was in a third party relationship. I don't know who I'm talking to. Drop it down there like it resonates, baby. Let me know, let a sister know where I'm going. Okay, cause I'm just telling you what I see. It was a past thing, yes. It was a past thing, but you walked away, got your strength back, got yourself under control, and now they peeping on you to see what you doing. You better holler at your girl. My battery getting low, but you better holler at your girl. I got to try to finish up the rest of these. Ooh, I thank y'all for, you know, sitting here watching it. I'm trying to make them short so y'all can get through all of them. You know, I know I'm making them funny for y'all, just keeping you laughing and rolling, but you know what? Laughter is medicine. Especially in a time like this. You know what I'm saying? So hit the like, subscribe button. If you got know somebody that got uh, Aquarius in their chart. Or oh, Gemini, what was I doing? Oh, Lord, I don't forgot. But anyway, if y'all got it, this in your chart, I'm going to have to see who this is. I just did. I think this was. Oh, Lord. Y'all y'all know I just went blank, didn't you? I just went totally blank. But uh, if you know somebody that got this Whoever this sign is, and they charge Gemini. It was Gemini. I'm sorry. It came back to me because I remember Gemini. So if you know somebody got Gemini in their chart, give them this video and let them see what's going on and let them check those actions, baby. Them swords is about action, about thoughts, okay, about energy, words, okay, communication. If you ain't got communication in your relationship, you don't want no creeping Somebody going to leave the door. Y'all saw the Queen of Cups ran out that door behind that page, didn't you? Do I need to remind y'all? Do I need to remind y'all? She went out there looking when you wasn't looking. There she is. I don't know how he got out of line, but he was right by her. Probably because the way I picked him up. There you go. Remember, she ran after him. Huh. He could be, the he, the page of cups could be she too, Okay. It could be vice versa, but I'm saying that person went after that other person because she was looking in that direction. So she went out too with her cup and he went out with his cup. You see what I'm saying? He holding up a cup. She holding up a cup. They like, okay, let's see if our two cups get, get you know, hey, get it on. All right now, y'all better, huh? y'all better, y'all better wake up. This 2020, it's about truth and clarity, baby. It's about the truth and the clarity. Coming to the real. Coming to the real. No more fake relationships out here. Mm Mm-mm. No more wasting time and energy, baby. Uh -uh 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 Uh-uh-uh-uh-uh. Thank y'all so much for watching, for, you know, love and support. Uh, I want to see you Gemini's on the scene. I want to give you some more readings. You know, you know, share this around. Karen is sharing. You're supposed to share knowledge. You're supposed to share enlightenment. Pass this along so somebody else can see it and get it. Because they may need to hear it. It might resonate with them, even if it don't resonate with you. It's okay, boo-boo. It's 8 billion people on this planet. It can't possibly resonate with everybody at the same time. That's not the way the universe works. We go through different things and different stages in our life. But you never know who this could help, so just share it. That's all you got to do. Share it. All right. Thank you. You know the drill. Peace, love, and harmony.